Uh, it's a beautiful winter day. The gods are happy because they delivered me this Peak Design Travel Tripod. I'm gonna take you guys with me while I test it out. Let's see you there. Hey guys, I'm Tom and in this series I am looking at the tools for creativity. And with that, I am looking at the next generate, well, can I say that? At least it's a cool new tripod. So a while ago I made a video about the Peak Design ecosystem. You can find that somewhere here in the top. And I think they might have added the last piece of the puzzle. Hear me out. I like to see myself as a run and gun filmmaker and a documentary photographer. That means that I am in the moment taking these shots and that also means that my gear has to be there when I need it most. That's also why I travel with a minimal setup, just not too much moving parts so I can rely on it when I need it. Introducing the Peak Design. Now the first thing that you will see is just how compact it is and if we get it out of this case, by the way, I will have designed this, it's really tight and it's really difficult to always put it in there again. I, I heard that, but still. So if you get it out, this is what it looks like and it's a really, really compact tripod, especially considered my other Siru, Siru, Siri, Siri? No, you, my other tripod. The one I got here is the aluminum version. Uh, they also have a carbon one, but for what I'm doing, this is more than enough. And also, I don't shit money. But weight-wise, it's still less than the one that you're standing on right now. Also, what's super easy is just how easy this thing packs inside of my backpack. It's just small, compact doesn't protrude so you're not walking around and hitting everyone in the eye um, just as it sticks out like some other uh, tripods. So let's see if we put it on here how that will go. Let's see how this performs. It's pretty sturdy and doing a lot of wiggling doesn't show that much. Let's see the center column. Yeah, that's that's not getting down. Well, there's just not much to say. It is a tripod, it's compact, it's sturdy, and well, it's designed for doing tripod stuff. So it got this newly designed ball head, but a little bit tricky because you have to lift it up to be able to move it. Then it's just a twist of the ring and you can actually put it however you want. It takes some getting used to, but it definitely is very, very sturdy. And then there's also this small mount, which is actually for your phone, which is hidden away in the center column. So you just take this and then you can just apply this one here. It's sturdy. And then all you need to do is put in your cell phone. I am really looking forward to see how this performs in the long run. So let's get back to that ecosystem and why I've become such a fanboy of the Peak Design stuff, including that thing over there. Their products are pricey, there's no way around that, but they're really, really quality products, especially with the lifetime warranty. If there's something wrong with it, you can just send them an email and they'll replace your stuff, no questions asked, if it's broken, of course. But even more than that, it's multifunctional. I always have my backpack with me with all of my gear. There's this capture clip, so I always have this close by when I need it. And then last but not least, there is the tripod, the missing piece from my kit so that means I can super easily switch from here just to the capture clip in one go. You have these anchor links that they make for like literally everything. You can just attach the sling to that and then you just put this around your shoulder and just carry it along. Now I'm pretty much covered wherever I go all of this ecosystem is there for me when I'm doing run and gun filmmaking. <laughs> There's just not a lot of gear I can say that about. It is time to move and actually get some clicks in. Like if you're fam, subscribe if you're new, but remember this channel, it is all about creativity.